How do you add a transition <coughs> to play during a live stream? Awesome question. I love this question. Let's go over here into my tutorial screen. All right, so um, you can see right over here we have scene transitions. I have two scenes loaded. Let's load something into this. Um, let's let's load something into this so we actually have something to transition to. We're going to remove the audio output capture. We're going to remove this, and we're going to remove this, and we're just going to add a video in here. We'll add our usual video because you know why not? I don't want to be too original. <laughs> uh. There we go. We're going to add that one. We're going to loop it. Boom. So now we have two. Um, now we have two scenes and you can see there is a transition there. It, this transition that it's using right now is called fade. I can drop this down and select other transitions. Uh, let's say we wanted to add a stinger transition here. I actually have a couple of really cool stinger transitions that I'm working on for some uh, for some packs that are going to be um, that are going to be released eventually sometime in the future so why not take a second and show you a little bit about some of those if I can find it there we go and I think we'll try this one here I have some transitions yeah I do so we could try this transition right here that's the first one um, I don't know, maybe this one, maybe this one. And then, so we loaded our transition video in here. We can preview it and that's what it's gonna look like. And I think we're gonna set it to frames and we're gonna do, we want our transition to happen 10 frames in, which means it's gonna switch from A, the first scene, to B, the second scene, after 10 frames. And we can preview that, it looks pretty cool. All right, so now we can go from scene one to scene two to scene one with our transition. And that is how you're gonna load your transitions into OBS. Now there are plenty of built-in ones to this Add Luma Wipe one has all kinds of really cool transitions that you could get right out of the box. Um, like this fan one here, which I think is really cool. So now, uh, there we go, see? And that's right in Luma Wipe, there's hundreds of these in there. So that's how you add a transition to your live stream, really super easy. Hopefully that answered your question. That was a good question, I like it. If you wanna see the full video I refer to in this clip, there is a link in the description so you can check it out for yourself. And if you wanna catch our live streams or see any of the hundreds of different videos I have over there to help make you a better live streamer, go ahead and check this channel out. My name is Michael Fire Jr. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day and I'll see you in the next one.